have you ever uh, faced any challenges uh, that have you know given you a setback and uh, any challenges in your journey that you would like to share and you know how did you overcome them or what is your lookout you know to deal with uh, adversity or challenges that come your way well uh you know i can't think of any one specific thing that was uh that, that I, nothing specific comes to mind, but I can just say that anytime you're in a field like this, any kind of artistic field, but you're also in a competitive situation, that can be a little bit tricky because, you know, being an artist of any sort is very, very personal. Mm -hmm. And so it's hard to take, not to take it personally, but you kind of need to do that. You know, if you if you get rejected or you don't win an audition, you're just like you just put that away and go on to the next one. But I think the main thing is that you know the you would use the same skills in a voiceover career that you would just use in your life, which is, you know, don't blame anyone for what's happening. You know, just look at how you can spin it to the positive for yourself. Or just, you know, there's a situation that happens and maybe it's not good for you and you kind of go, okay, well, how did this happen? What happened? How can I deal with this in a positive way? Um, because everything, you know, that sort of thing is going to come across, you know, in your relationship with clients um, is, you know, your attitude. So attitude is very, very important. Um, acceptance, you know, be grateful for what you have and just try to take what you have and work with it. And, you know, a little corollary to that. So get to know yourself, you mm. know. Now, it, that doesn't mean knowing yourself and knowing what, what your comfort zone is or what, what you like or what you don't like. It doesn't mean that that can't change somewhat. But you yeah. are who you are. Something distinguishes you from everyone else. And sort of get to know what that is and use it to your advantage. And uh, I also think the fact that you mentioned uh, that don't blame anyone. I think that's really, uh, you know, a powerful advice, even though if it seems that it's a very normal advice that we get from people. But I think taking responsibility, you know, for our generation or for anyone is a big thing. And not many people are able to take responsibility for their actions. Right. But I think the repercussions are and also if you don't take responsibility you have the repercussions that you have to deal with exactly because... well what i what i used to say <laughs> to my son is that okay this happened this happened this happened this happened this happened guess what they all had in common you <laughs> yeah <laughs> what could you have done differently what do you need to do differently you know mm -hmm. and it's it's it just Sometimes it's really, really hard. You'll run into people that are very, very difficult to deal with. Mm -hmm. And, you know, if you're lucky, maybe you can just not deal with those people, you know. But sometimes you have to deal with them because they're in your sphere and perhaps they're your boss or someone mm -hmm. that you have to deal with on a regular basis. And so if you can find some way to turn that into a positive thing, um, Sometimes it's hard to reach that inner person, but you know, there's there's a decent person I think in in most of us. You kind of have to try to go for that, go for that, go for that person. <laughs> yeah, and and I also think that uh, you know we kind of get stuck with the fact that you know why me, uh, you know why why do I have to face all this? And I think we overlook the fact that you know what can I do about it or what mm -hmm. next. Mm -hmm. So I think well, a so, shift in that perspective. Yeah, it's not just why me. I mean, stuff happens to everybody. You know, it's yeah. not it's not just you. I mean, every human being has issues. I mean, that's part of life. That's part of life. You know, and the sooner you can take responsibility, I think the happier you'll be because you because first of all, then that puts you sort of in control <laughs> in, in a situation where you might not feel control. You can kind of okay, well, how what can I do to make this better? You know, even yeah. just even just feeling better about it. Yeah, yeah, because they you know, and challenges never go away. 
challenges yeah. never go away. Um, I've lived long enough to say that there are different challenges at different decades. And, you know, they're just there. That's part of life. Susan, we had a really, uh, you know, amazing uh, chat today. But I would also like to ask you that, can we hear the voice of Siri for our viewers? Siri, say something to us. That oh, possible? of course. Oh, yes. Well, I very much appreciate being here today. Now, of course, this is the original voice of Siri. And um, yeah, I was sort of replaced by a millennial. And that's okay. That's the way the world goes. <laughs>